There you go. Run, run, run. Yeah, I wait, but I can't get my heart. <laughs>
disciple of Ramanus, his name was Kuresh, he saved Ramanus, he gave his own eyes to went to the king and king Locked. thought that he is Ramanus himself and he took the eyes of Kuresh and left him. So Kuresh, Kuresh was going here and there to meet his Gurudev. Uh, Ramanuja at once <coughs> left that country and he was coming to North India. In the way, <coughs> there was a village, there were two disciples of Ramanuj there. One was very rich and another was so poor. When Ramanu reached to that place, he stayed to a place and ordered his uh, dis one disciple, 
who was into the thing. About hundred disciples were with Raman is going into. So he taught, told his one disciple that go and tell to my rich disciple that I am coming to his home with hundred disciples. He went there and he knocked the door. The rich person came and he told that Ramanuj with hundred disciples are coming to your home. He is going to North India, but in the way he saw that your village is here and you are here. He went, returned inside the room and began to prepare so many things that or my Guru Devi is coming. But he did not told anything to that disciple who went to give this message. And she, he was engaged and he forgot that my any brother is there. I take this. Incense. Incense. <coughs> then he was waiting about one hour for him, but he was engaged inside the room. And he was with her family, he began to cook or doing so many services. But he forgot that my God was here and waiting outside. That devotee, the messenger, returned to Ramanuj and told that I went to his home, knocked and he came and I told the message. And he again entered the room and he never returned till one hour I was waiting. Then we should must go to that poor um, disciple. Don't tell anything, no message, nothing. We should go. So with hundred disciples, they went to the cottages <laughs> of them who are disciples. The disciple was outside of his home, anywhere to bake. He was so pure. But his wife was there, so beautiful, young lady. But they were so poor that there is no good cloth to hear. When Ramanus knocked the door, she was shining. But he was what glad that my Guru Deva has come here. So, so over that, that he don't care that she was like naked, worn and torn clothes there. And he did pranam to Gurudev. Gurudev saw that she like naked, worn and torn clothes, so he gave his chadar to her and she wrapped it. Then all went to his house. Now she was thinking, nothing, my husband has gone to wait something. And in home house, nothing is there. How to serve my Gurudev? He was at once remembered that nearby his home house, there was a very rich uh, business person, Baniya, business person. And he has a very bad eyes on this uh, beautiful devotee. And he has told so many prastav, proposal, proposal. That you should come to me and in my house with me you should live. Like, like a um, wife, you should give up that devotee. I will give you so much appellants and you will be like a queen here. But he never agreed, he always refused. 
But anyhow, he has not told to his hus husband, her husband. Now she remembered that my Gurudev will be fasting here. My husband is not here. So how I can serve my Gurudev? She at once went to that bad person. She told that my Gurudev is here. Can you help me? Yes. But you will have to agree with my proposal. Yes, I am agree. I am agree. But I want something. Chawal, dal, rice and all these things. My Gurudev has come with hundred disciples. She thought that what is the use of this being chaste? Yet my Gurudev is returning empty-handed and not to be served. So I don't want to be chaste or anything. For my Guru service, for Krishna, I can give anything. So went direct and told. She get, he get what she wanted. Uh, so much things for hundred. Not for one day, in evening also. And how many days his Guru will be there? So he asked so much and he gave everything. And she <coughs> told that today in night I will meet you. Told me, yes, I am giving. So he gave everything. She came and cooked so much and she was overjoyed. When it was ready, she gave, offered to Krishna and he told that also she and she began to, she told other disciples to serve, to serve this. When they were, uh, took their prasad and they were ready, they were ready to take some rest. In the meantime, he has been trained. He saw that my Gurudev with hundred disciples is here. Oh, he was so overjoyed. But today he has nothing in his begging. She went to his wife and told he that now what to do? What to prepare? How we can serve? She told her, don't be worried. All are shut, all are happy, now they are taking rest, don't worry. Go and serve your Gurudev by messaging because he is coming from you know, far. Amen. He told that, I want to know that how you prepared all these things, from where you collected. When he messaged and his Gurudev was taking rest, then he returned. His wife told, but for so long time he was pursuing me bad proposals, but I never had that. Today I saw that my Gurudev is here with hundred disciples. I must serve Gurudev. How can I serve? I thought that what is the use of this? physical body. So I went to him and I directly told that I want these things and he agreed but he told that today in night you will have to come and satisfy me. So I have told him. So in evening he prepared again so much thing and sat to Gurudev and disciples and when they were sleeping in the mid time his husband came and uh, yes now you should go. I am coming with you. It was so much rainy and so cold. So his husband took her wife on the shoulder and took an umbrella and he went to that rich person's home. Now see, uh, she alone she told that you should be here and go. Is that meant that? Yes, you should go. No harm. 
she went with some prasad, remnants of his Gurudev. And he was waiting for a very long time. When she will come? When she will come? When she will come? He saw that she is coming, become so happy, and smiling the, this woman, lady devotee, gave the remnant of Rama. First take it. And when he tasted, at once he was changed. At once, totally changed. How you can? I am saying that it is a sovereign, but you are not wetted. Understand? Mm -hmm. So, <coughs> how you come here? My husband has brought me. Oh, your husband has brought me. <laughs> if I had flight on the lotus seat of that devotee, please accept me. I have done so much wrong. You are semi goddess. Now I have changed. Just now I want to go to your Gurudev and take. Diksha and Harina. Hello, yes. Wet for morning. Now he is taking rest. Anyhow, now he was so much chan in the morning, very clean, set, taking bath. He came to Ramanuj and fled. Your disciples are so much serving you that they have. Turn my heart. I want to take just now initiation. I don't want to delay a moment. Ramani heard all these things. Actually, he was weeping. I'm thinking. I'm so. Bhagavan, Bhagavan, fortunate to have a disciple like you. Disciples like you are very At the same moment, Kuresh, searching him, Gurudev, came there. And he wanted to take the son of Gurudev. Agamal was take his hand, took his hand up, kept on the Kuresh, and he has now two so beautiful eyes, and he looked and fell flat on Raman. Oh, Raman is very powerful. Eyes came and all that is tossed. This is Guru Shiva. Huh? One hand, Kuresh, and other hand, this lady. They become famous in history. Even today, they all Bow down to that lady. Hmm? Go, Prama. You should give something to all devotees. Prema Pradeep. I've taken today four hearts. <laughs> we have many more hearts in the kitchen. <laughs> 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 the the also. <laughs> you you should be wish for more. So nice. Yeah. One should be given to my Nami. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. And with that, I will go and take. <laughs> Would you like some sweetness? Give it also to Nami. You should give any pot. Is it in the pot? Container. Uh, in the pot, we need the sweetness. We need the table. Or just a container. Container. Mix. Get done. <laughs> Be ready quickly. Yes. My time will pass. <laughs> we'll have to take all.
for Nishinga Chaturdashi. Parana. Mm. So you should take and do Parana. Yeah. Thank you so much for blessing Bring any pot? None. Otherwise it will be cold. Cold. If it is, then you should also distribute. Oh, 
After. You don't dance. You're gonna dance? Okay, then you do the first dance. Dance. That's a dance. Something going on. She wants to get it. She wants to get See, look, rice, mango, and dal. Make dance, then after that you can take and, okay. and keep it with it. Okay, so you dance now. This is going to be. So you have to dance. Okay, just a little bit. Okay, and later you finish. No, but after. After, after. Because it's hot. You have to release. It's too hot. You don't need a spoon. So now you dance. Okay. Okay. Come on. I'm going to take one dress. Yeah, one dress. Stand up, and I'm going to sing you. When he will take shadi, it will be. Oh, hey, sorry. And sorry. Sorry tomorrow. He will give an excuse. <laughs> okay. You going to dance? Yes or no? Okay. One, two. Do you want me to sing? Yes. Okay. Are we going to uh, which one? I'll stay here. Sigurd in India. Okay. 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 Mother Guru does not sing me. With a look, with a look. No, stop. Okay. Forget the rice. <laughs> no. You dancing or not dancing? <laughs> then afternoon. No problem. She is too much. I'm sorry, Marish. She is bothering me. Come on, out, don't say in, outside. In, in, outside. Outside. Yeah, but make a big mess. Come on. There. See you later. I want to eat here. Radhika, Radhika, do you know how to dance? You don't know how to dance? <laughs> you do, I thought you did. Do you know how to dance? Sure. Can you show me? What kind of dance do you do? And we'll take your picture. We'll take a picture of you, okay? And you can see it later. She's hungry eating her fingers. <laughs> of course, she's a oh. vegetarian. Yeah, this too, we know. Her fingers are <laughs> uh, uh, Maybe it's her fingers you're eating a bit. Something you don't You do like punch? Yeah. Do like punch. And then I give you this. Seven days. Come on. Come on. Come on. She's done. Come
So seeing those impurities, if we say, oh, this water is not good, I'm not going to touch that water, I'll become more dirty. So this will be an offense to that holy river and holy water. But those who know that and those who have full faith, despite seeing all those impurities on the surface of water, they, they dip and then they are blessed with the mercy of Ganges. What is the meaning of Sobhav Janitai? Due to nature of body. What, is, what it means? If he has a deformed body or a diseased body. No, this is not so hard. His, his, he's always situated in his original constitutional position as Krishna consciousness. Hmm. Shabhav Janitai Bapusha. Bapu is separate body. If his nature. If he has uh, what nature? If he seems to have something wrong with his character. What? No, no, not character. Sometimes if he become angry, a rough is speaking. Uh, giving some. Yeah. Like one was Aviram Thakur, giving chap to him. This. This, these are sobhav, nature, by the nature of body, sometimes they become, without any reason, angry. So seeing this, a rough behavior, a rough speech. speech, don't care for this. If there is a gold, but this gold has fallen down in a stool. Very good, weak gold. But it is covered or it is within a nali drain, drain where all used to make make his or, uh, then what do you do you see here and there and give some water and then take it <laughs> huh? understand no yeah. well, you should explain what I told that even if one finds gold in a filthy place yeah. the gold is still as valuable and an intelligent person will take that gold, gold. anyway Anyway, no consideration. Gold never becomes impure. So if bhakti is there in anyone, and he is actually a Vaishnava, or sometimes angry, rough Hearts word. words, rough behavior, even we should try to serve him and to please him and take bhakti. Understand? He is a rough uh, speaking person. So I do Then you will lose. Hmm? So, we should be very careful with this. Sabha, um, and then Bapu. Sabha, Janitai, Bapu, Shastya, Dosha. And other things. Kiva, Bipra. Kiva, Nyasi. Shudra Kenu Noy, J. Krishna Tatta Vetta Se Guru Vash. Go to any person who is Tatta Vetta, whether he is Brahmachari, Grihastha, Panprasti, out of society, no harm. He may be mountain like Haridas Thakur, no harm. You should go and take this thing. If you are doing anything, thinking that he is ugly, he is black, his teeth are like this, he is a rough um, speaking person, then it will be offensive in your thing. And you will be cheated. So don't be like that. Also, don't try to give 
What? Advice. Why? If you think that he is full, then you will give advice. Otherwise, no. So if you are advising, thinking that he is foolish, then it is offensive. Don't advise and what? Don't try to discipline him. To correct him. Don't try to correct him. That is, you are incorrect. You should do like this. Jannama, you know? No. Jannama. He was sitting in the council of Harikatha. And a person was telling Harikatha. And she was sitting like you are sitting. And she was chanting Hare Krishna. The person who was the speaker, he thought that I am now. Uttam Mahabhagavat. And he told Janama Devi, it is very bad to chant Hari name when Bhagavat is going on. You don't know that Srimad Bhagavat is himself Krishna and you are chanting here. At once whole assembly, assembly they, yeah, they were so much offended and they told, they all uska bahishkar kar diya. Reject him. Bahishkar mein hai? Reject or bahishkar. Bahishkar him. Bahishkar him. That we don't want to hear from you. Janate ji Iswari herself is who? Potential Vita Ananda Prabhu. And also? Anand Manjari. He is out of control of anyone. Rules and regulations is out of all. <coughs> he can be less and less forms. Here also, there also, chanting, remembering, hearing, everything he can do. So there should be no control on their Vaishnava. No. And at last he was bycotted by the whole Vaishnava. No. And he became Patibari Rupa. Rupa Kapirat. So we should not try to correct him or anything, those who are advanced. But try to be corrected by them. Also, don't think that Krishna consciousness is limited to a certain section of people or certain section of devotees or a certain tract of land, don't think this. We will hear only to those who are in certain section of devotees. Don't do all these offenses. Be liberated. Try to honor all the Vaishnava. Then Shat Krishna Macharita Adi Sita Upadidya Pito Pritakta Rasnasya Rochikanu we should not try to avoid all these things. Oh, I am now Madhyam Adhikari and these are for only Kanishta Adhikari, so we should not have taste in this. Don't do. Otherwise, you will have offense in the lotus feet of Rupa Goswami. Don't try. Don't try. You should try always to be established in these truths. These are very helpful. Up till Bhavastha we have some anarth. Some anarth are there. So if you will displease Vaishnava, Bhakti, Bhagavan, then your Madhya Madhikar will be gone. So don't think like this. So try to read this again and again and try to follow all these instructions. And if you are not following all these instructions, it means that you are not advancing in bhakti, you are going gradually lower in the 
Tu. Tu. Uh, engage in your worldly requirements. Better, better job. Those who know, they can do. Those who know, they can come and do. Shat Krishna Amacharita Adi Sita Api Vidyo Itop Tarasana Rochita Anu Kain Tadra Adi Anu Dhanu Khalu Shai Vajusta Swadhi Kramat Audi Tadvada Mool Hain Read the translation The holy name, character, pastime... Where is that? The holy name, character, pastimes and activities of Krishna are all transcendentally sweet like sugar candy. Although the tongue of one afflicted by the jaundice of avidya, ignorance, cannot taste anything sweet, it is wonderful that simply by carefully chanting these sweet names every day, a natural relish awakens within his tongue and his disease is gradually destroyed at the root. Uh, first, uh, disease will be destroyed or first test will come, then this will go away. Or first, uh, the disease will go away, then test will come. First, first taste comes and then the disease goes away. Unless one is... Is it telling right? Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. First disease will go. I think that disease so must go, then sweetness will come. Or some test will come, then disease will go. What is this? Niyam. Kya niyam? Yes. Both are taking place at the same time. Simultaneous both are going on at the same time. But... Uh, Medicine is needed first or that thing, that will go without medicine gradually. Medicine must be there. So first medicine. Harinam is medicine and everything. So Harinam should be taken first. Then disease will go. But disease will go, then I will take medicine and then I will test it. This is not thing. So, in what position you are, you should be there, no harm. You are lusty, you are loyal, you, are, you have so much worldly desires, you are what? Anything you must be. <coughs> but take that mission first. But try to not take the things which are warned. But medicine should be taken. So medicine is Harina. So this should take. Gradually the disease will go. So when a test will come in medicine, that in a Harina, some little. How? By taking, 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 taking. So if you are taking Harina, and being the association of any good, good association, like we are here doing Kirtan, Hari Katha Samas. So all the little boys, even girls, olds, young, all are energetic. All are dancing. All are doing so many things. So kinds of services here, here in all this. So this thing should be must adopted. Now purport. The holy name of Lord Krishna, his quality, pastimes, and so forth, are all of the nature of the absolute truth, beauty, and... The holy name, character, pastimes, activities of Krishna. Everything is transcendental. Oh. And transcendentally they are sweet. But we are taking Harinam, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. 
हरे कृष्णा हरे वाई वाई नो टेस्ट वी आर हियरिंग हरि कथा बट आवर माइंड इज देयर हाउ यू न्यू आई न्यू बिकॉज इफ आई विल क्वेश्चन दे विल टू दैट आई डोंट अंडरस्टैंड इफ वट इज द मीनिंग If I will tell, I want to make your marriage with very, very, very beautiful any lady devotee. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> what is she? <laughs> very trustful. <laughs> But when I'm telling Hari Katha, actually. <laughs> What is the meaning? That his mind is anywhere else, and then sleeping. But he wants to know that it is surely a very sweet thing. I must take it. Then he will be careful. All are sweet, but now you are thinking in Mathura or anywhere, a devotee was like this. that when we began to used to begin kirtan very loudly and first uh, what thick 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 like this thick and then ta first thick makes it him like we <laughs> get used to sleep we never used to come to our classes and after some time he, he went to his home he bought a rickshaw and after that he was badly engaged in worldly things and then he again began to collect fishes here there in mud sand here so if we have no test in hari katha There no test in Hari Nam, no anything. <coughs> First <coughs> test should come in here. If there is no test again, I will see. I will hear. Bhagwat was going on in Bindavan. Who was explainer? So Ragnath Bhatta. Always. Hearing the past times of gopis, when Krishna went to Mathura, all were feeling by his explanations. All were fact feeling separation, but one person, he was not. His heart, his heart was not melting. He took something from his pocket, and that was chili. powder and he gave it in his eye <laughs> and tear began <laughs> he was looking ragnath bhatta after class class finishing he went to that person and he took and embraced him oh i have heard that any Just devotee thinks that I have not service. I have not served Vishnuva Bhagavatam. So I punished my body. Tears are now com coming from eyes. So these eyes should be punished. punished. I saw that you took something and punished your eyes. Then this was coming. Surely you are a very fortunate person. So, I am hearing this and having embraced by him, he began to be <laughs> automatically tears came. Anyhow, he is repenting for that that devotee, and he knows that uh, there is so many offences in me, anath in me, that my heart is not melting. So I should do anything. i am not qualified to be in this council of 
Vaishnavas who are all weeping, all are doing so. So we should realize also all these things. If there is no tear, no hair standing. No heart melting, then we should show that. We are so much but offended. We have done offenses anywhere. We are full of earth. So, these are uh, all earth incidentally sweet, more than sugar, honey, but yet we have no, nothing. So there is something behind it. Yes. And then? Naturally these names are very sweet, like sugar candy, which appeals to everyone. Neshens, however, is compared to the disease called jaundice, which is caused by bilious secretions. Attacked by jaundice, the tongue of a diseased person cannot palatably relish sugar candy. Rather, a person with jaundice considers something sweet to taste very bitter. Avidya, ignorance, similarly perverts the ability to relish the transcendentally palatable name, quality, form, and pastime of Krishna. Despite this disease, if one with great care and attention takes to Krishna consciousness, chanting the holy name, and hearing Krishna's transcendental pastimes, his ignorance will be destroyed and his tongue enabled to taste the sweetness of the transcendental nature of Krishna and his paraphernalia. You can take an example. Krishna is like sugar, sugar candy. His names are like sugar candy. His all pastimes are like that. When Krishna appeared in the council of comes at Ranga study by a crew, Krishna and Baldev were there. Charan Mosti comes and all bad persons were there also. <coughs> twelve kinds of persons saw Krishna in twelve way. Same sugar country, Krishna. But they tested all in different modes. How Krishna comes um, how is tested this that? Yeah, actually, he began to shake by seeing Krishna, and the other courtyards of Kansa, his uh, associates. How this are? How this are? Ashani. Like thunderbolt. Nidam Narabara. All the persons Narabara. They saw that Krishna is so beautiful, marvelous. Among all persons is most Beautiful, superior, having quality and other things. Nidam Narvara, Istrinam Smara, all the wives of Jadav, they saw Krishna like Kamdev. All were charmed by Krishna. And then Gopanang Svajano. All the gops are that he is my friend, Subhad Sridham over there. And Nanda Baba and Vasudev, uh, Devaki Desha, he is my son, own son. The Gyani, Brahma Gyani and all others, they are Tattam Parama Yoginam, Tattva, Paratattva. Mithyu Bhojapate, Kansa that his life, death. death. Asatan Khiti Bhujan, all the bad kings, 
were invited by Kams. They saw that he is my all controller and they feared. And Vishni Nang Paradevata. Vishni means? Uh, the persons of Vishni di dynasty. This all. What this all? Paradevata. Paradevata means history. So, the, they were like twelve, and they said twelve are here like the old history. Kans was a rogi of this jaundice. His courtyards were jaundice. But something, but a stage different. No? Different degree. Different degree. And there were bhakta of different qualities. So according to them, they tested the same Krishna. Krishna, uh, Kans become angry, all other becomes angry. And the father, mother, Jadu, Jadavi, Vaishnava, and Jog, they become so happy to see Krishna. So Krishna is like a sugar candy. But first if you will take, then it will be very bitter, very bitter. But gradually taking it, uh, the disease will go and then you will follow that it is very sweet. When it will be tested very sweet, then you should see that our robe has been done. Go on. Such a recovery of spiritual health is possible only by the regular cultivation of Krishna consciousness. We should not give up. If it is not test follow, no harm. You should continue it. If sleep, sleeping is coming, no harm. Chant loudly, loudly. There was a Vaishnav, our Siksha Guru. He was telling that when I came first in the touch of Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Goswami Thakur, at that time, first in first my career, I used to sleep when chanting. So I discovered the way that upper side there was like this. I took a rope and tightened by Sikha to there and chanting Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. And if come <laughs> like this. The whole night doing Hare, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. After that we saw in his old days, always chanting. Always chanting. No mala, no harm. Always chanting. He was the very beloved of Srila Bhakti Siddhan Saraswati Goswami. And very bosom friend to our Gurudev. All sannyasis used to tell him, Narhari da, Dada. Like Vinod Dada, they all used to, all senior Vaishnava and sannyasis used to tell my Gurudev, Vinod Dada. And he also. Narahari Dada. He was the mother of whole Gauriyas. Prabhupada also used to call her that. Yes. Narahari Dada. <laughs> so, he used to do like that. If you are asleep, you can tie your legs, shikha to there, and when, then it will. And it should be done anything. Anything. Always, when sleepiness or alas, alas means laziness coming. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Ram, Hare Ram, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, and jumping, and jumping, jumping and doing Hare Krishna, like this, nidra will go away, sleeping, and then sit down. Remember Krishna pastimes. Dhamo Dar Lila. Adar Lila. Going to Govardhan Parikrama. Vrindavan Parikrama. Then? When a man in the material world 
takes more interest in the materialistic way of life than in Krishna consciousness, he is considered to be in a diseased condition. Mm. The normal condition... Almost all we are like that. I think the rare are like that. They are testing all these things. And they don't go towards worldly, how to maintain our life, how to be happy, how to have the very beautiful house and all other things. They don't go towards. How to make our love and affection so qualified. They only try for this. Hmm. The normal condition is to remain and eternal servant of the Lord. Hmm. This healthy condition is lost when the living entity forgets Krishna due to being attracted by the external features of Krishna's Maya energy. This world of Maya is called Durashraya. Hmm? Durashraya. Which means false or bad shelter. Hmm. One who puts his faith in Durashraya becomes a candidate for hoping against hope. In the material world, everyone is trying to become happy, and although their material attempts are baffled in every way, due to their nescience, they cannot understand their mistakes. People try to rectify one mistake by making another mistake. This is the way of the struggle for existence in the material world. If one in this condition is advised to take to Krishna consciousness and be happy, he does not accept such instructions. This Krishna consciousness movement is being spread all over the world just to remedy this gross ignorance. People in general are misled by blind leaders. The leaders of human society, the politicians, philosophers, and scientists, are blind because they are not Krishna conscious. According to Bhagavad Gita, because they are bereft of all factual knowledge due to their atheistic way of life, they are actually sinful rascals and are the lowest among men. Namam dusritina mudha prabhajan te naradama mayaya prabhita jnana Asuram Bhavama Shrita. Those miscreants who are grossly foolish, <coughs> lowest among mankind, whose knowledge is stolen by illusion, and who partake of the atheistic nature of demons, do not surrender to me. Such people never surrender to Krishna, and they oppose the endeavor of those who wish to take Krishna's shelter. When such atheists become leaders of society, the entire atmosphere is surcharged with nations. In such a condition, people do not become very enthusiastic to receive this Krishna consciousness movement. Just as a diseased person suffering from jaundice does not relish the taste of sugar candy. However, one must know that for jaundice, Sugar candy is the only specific medicine. Similarly, in the present confused state of humanity, Krishna consciousness, the chanting of the holy name of the Lord, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, is the only remedy for setting the world aright. Uh, one thing. Once, I took a stone and it, I throw down, throw it in a very big pond, like lake, two miles, three miles abroad. Eh? When I throw it, some wet round, what? First, second, third, fourth, fifth, né? and touching the last end of the lake. Here, 
there, here, here, everything. If it is very nearer to one shore, from there, like this, like this, like this, everywhere in the lake we can see it. In this way, if anyone chant Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, what becomes? It vibrates in the air. And it goes to end, to last end of the world. Not only this world, it covers all universe, Swarga, Martha, Patal. It goes to Vaikuntha, unlimited. So all are touched by this. It purifies the whole atmosphere, whole world. I'm singing here. Anyone very famous uh, singer is musician is singing. And I'm in the last end of the world anywhere, having some machine there, I'm hearing and seeing him there. So if their machines are good, then it will vibrate more there and they will clearly see. But those have no machine, then what they will do? But function will be go there. It will purify whole atmosphere in whole world. If you chant more, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, especially when in a and all are singing, <coughs> this voice will go and atmosphere will be all purified. So don't think that it is useless to do kirtan. Even one is so much purified, so much. Like Gorkusho Dasavaj Maharaj Srila Prabhupada. Arnarottam Thakur Arupa Shani Chant Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare What it will do? If less person are chanting more loudly, but this sound is more effective, more strong, it will throw their five whole world. It has two functions internally and outwardly. Huh? When we throw any stone in the water, we see outwardly some currents going everywhere, one, two, three, four, five, there. And if anything like doing those. But internally, it is a power who makes this. So if you chant, outwardly something will be seen, that here going, here going, and affecting, making what um, all atmosphere, but very purified. But internally what we will do? It will change your heart. Not only change your heart, but those who are in this whole atmosphere in the world, he are chanting, but it will go everywhere and it will purify also heard and you develop Krishna pain. But we are not realizing, but it is working. No? So you should think that it is very powerful. This name, if you have no ruchi yet, again and again, doing, 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 you will see that a test will come. Your heart will be changed, your Krishna Prem will develop, and whole Vatavaran atmosphere will be very clear, pure. So always think this very soundly. This word will not help you. Never. Don't go to test anything. Anything. <coughs> Try to change your spirit and mood. This is Krishna consciousness. We see that how he is praising Krishna consciousness, Swamiji. But how 
living in this Krishna consciousness, even for long time, twenty, twenty-five years, doing chanting, remembering, going here and there. But again they left it and went. Why? Why? It must be some offenses. Or from beginning he had no test. He wanted to test worldly things and by means of Kirtan and Harikatha. They misused it. <coughs> they don't want to develop Krishna thing. They wanted what? By this chanting, then all will come and respect me. And then I will test all worldly things very easily. All will do pranam to me. They will go and give me what I will do. One lakh dollars, two lakh dollars. And then I will buy a car of one, doll, one lakh dollars. And then I will make my room of golden, all these things. And thus deprived of what? So always think all these things. And chant only for developing Krishna, Krishna, Krishna consciousness. Being in Vrindavan, after that slow will come. Then go on. The real disease is in her. The real disease is in the heart. If the mind is cleansed, however, if consciousness is cleansed, a person cannot be harmed by the material disease. Material disease is nothing. We don't for, uh, fear for or worry for material diseases. They cannot do any harm. But this will do so much harm. We fear for only outer diseases, not for inner diseases, but we should do. And we should take, we take all the diseases things, that disease will gradually develop. To cleanse the mind and heart from all misconceptions, one should take to this chanting, one should take to this chanting of the Hare Krishna Maha Mantra. Mm. This is both easy... They should take in legal process. Otherwise, it will not be fruitful. The outer judges will go on. It will develop. This is both easy and beneficial. By chanting the holy name of the Lord, one is immediately freed from the blazing fire of material existence. Hmm. Those who are falling, chanting always. I hmm? that I am chanting always. Um, Sixteen drunk, or holy master has told this. By chanting and doing all day, fear that preaching everything. Why they they are falling? What is the cause? We should think. We should think it. Why? There is some loophole. Certainly there is. We should try to discover and try to stop the leakage. Otherwise, we can. Water will not be a store. All will go by <coughs> these holes. So our water is going like this. So we should try to be careful for all these things. Hmm. There are three stages in chanting the holy name of the Lord. Mm. The offensive stage, mm. the stage of lessening offenses, mm. and the pure stage. Yes. When a neophyte takes to the chanting of the Hare Krishna mantra, he generally commits many offenses. Mm. There are ten basic offenses, mm. and if the devotee avoids these, he can glimpse the next stage which is situated between offensive chanting and pure chanting. When one attains the pure stage, he is immediately liberated. This is called Bhava Maha Davagani Nirvapanam. Mm. As soon as one is liberated from the blazing fire of material existence, 
he can relish the taste of transcendental life. The conclusion is that in order to get free from the material existence, one must take to the chanting of the Hare Krishna mantra. The Krishna consciousness movement is especially meant for creating an atmosphere in which people can take to the chanting of the Hare Krishna mantra. One must begin with faith. Now, something is going wrong. Any devotees cannot go in that center. Why? If anyone chanting, you will go and tell that on, uh, we are coming from Narayan Maharaj's hearing. And if we want to take the son of deity and to hear Harikatha, or to so called Bogus person. So it is a very worry thing. You should be always careful for this. <coughs> so, we will speak tomorrow. Now time is over. More than one hour. One hour. Huh? <coughs> so we will finish it tomorrow. Very carefully we should take all these things and try to take in our heart. And thus chant Hari. Our heart should be uh, like open. Our body or this or one is one. One. Some politics behind. Oh. You are very good to vote. I know you. And when he goes away, I am a very wicked person. <laughs> Don't do this. Sam, if he is very bad person, and if you have very good will for him to help him, you can advise him very politely, and if you are a very qualified person, and if you have some good will for him, then he will uh, uh, listen to your teachings. Otherwise, no, never. And be first purified your heart with first, and then try to do. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu in his life of brooming Gundicha Mantra. He was brooming more than anyone and he was teaching all. Oh. So we should do like that. One Kirtan should be done. Kirtan and no Kirtan
जाते हो Anything? 
yesterday in yes play? yes yes the young brahmana young brahmana of sakshi <laughs> and what you i was the village village there now you were in the council Right. And you? All Brahmana. Yes. And the other sister, <laughs> you were? I was the wife. She was the wife of the Brahmana. The old Brahmana's wife. And your child? The daughter was Hari Vallabha. She's... Very good. Oh, Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Sean, <laughs> remember and be happy. Yeah. We will meet in evening. Hmm. At about four, your kid Nagar can Four. 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 Okay. Yes, and then oh, yes. I should also come with you at four. It depends how you feel. Four thirty, you said. Um, we can no. We can, we can bring in car. Yes. We can bring in car. Yes. Yeah. You follow us. If you like. You come. Nagar Sankirtan will be disturbed by that car. No, after Nagar Sankirtan, you come. After Nagar Sankirtan, I. Okay. 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 Hare Krishna.